Batman and Robin. Welcome to the channel where I like to inspire, encourage, and include you in packing Operation Christmas Child shoeboxes year round. Um, today, I went in all in <laughs> on my latest purchase from Oriental Trading. So, I had to wear pink for the flamingo because I'm always matchy matchy. Also, that um, Matt man, you can't see him, he's sitting on the couch. He is playing video games in the background, so he's joining us today. Um, I hope that's not distracting. If it is, let me know. But it's live. This is our Saturday morning, and this is how we do what we like to do and do it together separately. <laughs> But I still feel like we're together. So, anyway, this is my big haul slash review from Oriental Trading. Um, my first purchase, I also recorded that, was my first time to kind of get an idea of what is good out there at Oriental Trading. And then um, a friend, Lynette, who's also here in Texas, sent me another box of all of her favorite things. So I learned a lot from that haul as well. So this time when I received in the mail this $20 gift card from Oriental Trading, um, these actually go to my mom and she gives them to me because she doesn't have any use for these. Um, we don't know why she gets them in the mail, but they send them to her frequently. So this is my second purchase with this. So what I decided to do is right now, Oriental Trading has free shipping on $50 purchases. $50 is a lot of money for us, a lot. But with this card, the $20 gift card, $50 now becomes $30. And I view it as 40% off, basically. So everything that I got in here, I viewed it as 40% off from its regular price. So I do just kind of want to let you know what it looks like when you order from Oriental Trading. Um, what they do is they put all your stuff in this box and right on top, they also have this $100 wine voucher, which we are not going to use. So if um, you want to use this voucher, the code on there, the first person to get to it can use it. I don't know if you need any of this information, but just pause the front and back and you can use it if you want this $100 wine voucher that we won't use. The next thing they send you is their most recent, uh, I, would, I would call this their mini catalog. I also received, after I made this purchase, their large um, Halloween magazine catalog it's a full-size catalog this one's like a baby catalog i really wish i had had that before i made this purchase because it was so much easier to see the things that even i could search for searching on oriental trading is a chore and a task but i think i did okay you just kind of have to think of what you want maybe you want bracelets maybe you want necklaces or bandanas or stickers you just kind of have to search that in their bar and then sort by price to get the best deals. That's what I did and it took me a really long time to find all of these things, but really it's kind of like hunting and I enjoyed it a lot. I had a lot of fun. I took several days just adding things to my cart and sometimes those things would disappear before I got a chance to purchase them, but that's okay because I think that I did a really good job with all the things that I got. The next thing that they're going to send you is your invoice of purchase. Everything that you bought um, and just the list to make sure that you got everything that you paid for, how much you spent, all your taxes, your shipping, your discounts, and everything will be on this little manifesto. Now let's get into the good stuff. So um, some of these things I bought for specific boxes. And some of these things I bought for pencil packs um, or just to go in masses. And even a couple of the things I bought specifically to send into the distribution center as filler already as they are. So let's jump in. This is something I didn't think about looking for at Oriental Trading, but they are cups. So if you can see, this is 
an Encanto cup. So that is Mirabelle, and I love her to death. She is so cute and so free-spirited, and I am doing an Encanto box. So this is called an Encanto Favor Cup, and on the website, regular price, it is 98 cents. I have a little sticky in here to remember. Um, so with my free $20 gift card or the 44% off, <laughs> I'm that man, he's letting Bella in. Um, okay. I only paid 58 cents for this cup and I love it and it's great. It's the same quality as the ones like this that you can get at Dollar Tree or Walmart. So I really loved it. The next thing I got was the same kind of cup, but it was Barbie themed. And I haven't seen a Barbie themed one at my Walmart or Dollar Tree in quite a while. So I went ahead and jumped in, bit the bullet and got this. Plus I have this specific Barbie. So I'm definitely going to include this cup with this Barbie. Um, and it is called Barbie Dream Together Favor Cup. And regular price was $1.49, so I got it for 89 cents. I love it, perfect. Um, another thing that I bought for a specific box is, kind of digging here, this. What in the world is this? So, it's actually called a River Canyon Vest, but, isn't it cute? It's just a little dress up vest. It's not high quality, like it's not high quality clothing. This wouldn't be a piece of clothing that you would wear anywhere. It's just a piece of clothing that you play in. And I think that it's going to get lots of reuse as a play thing. Um, I think that it is technically a life vest um, because on here on the back, it says equipped for venture, equipped for adventure. And they call it a river canyon vest. But to me, it gave me construction vibes. So I'm going to put this in a box for a boy, two to four years old, that is a construction theme, so he can dress up like a construction worker. That's my thought process. It was originally um, on their website, a dollar and 17 cents. So I got this bad boy for 70 cents, and I hope that it makes this little boy's day. 70 cents all day long. I think that might be the only things that I bought that were individual one-offs that were for a specific box. Everything else in here might be for specific boxes, but they came in multiples. So next, let's get into these stickers. I know you've seen these stickers and I've seen other um, YouTubers haul them, which made me know that they're good quality. I also received some from my friend Lynette Sorry, I have a little trash can over here, so. But this is what they look like in the roll, when they come in the roll. I have my little note over here inside this, so I know how much I spent and how much they are all worth. Um, again, so these are rolls of stickers. Here is, I'm gonna show you the difference, the comparison. This one is called Wild Encounter, and they come in squares. And there are five different um, images, and they repeat. So that is what they look like. This is the five, the Wild Encounter. And then this one is called Treasure Hunt, and it also has five different images. And this is what they look like. They're both really cute. They're both the same quality. However, if you want to look, I think that the square ones, which are Wild Encounter, are a little bit bigger and the images are a little bit more fun. So if you have to pick between one of these two, I recommend this one. What these are great for and what I've purchased them for is to go in my mini pencil packs that I'm making as filler. These will fit perfectly in a two by nine bag, which is what a lot of people use for pencil pack fillers. And how much I spent on these. These on their website are regular $1.27. So guys, that's already about the same as Dollar Tree prices. There are 100 stickers on here. So what I did to figure out the price is I broke it up into sets. So there are five stickers 
options and what I would do is cut them off at the five mark and then another one at the five mark. So I will get 20 sets of stickers out of each of these rolls. So for $1.27, each set of stickers is only six cents regular price. However, I got them for the 40% off 76 cents per roll, which makes each set of five stickers only four cents for me. That's the kind of deal I'm looking for for my pencil packs. So I hope that that was insightful for you about these different sticker rolls. Next is something that I probably would not recommend that you purchase and I won't purchase again in the future, but I'm glad I did just to kind of get an idea. This is called, what do they call it? Science VBS Fold Up Verses. So my thought again is pencil packs. I wanted something fun to color to just drop into each pencil pack. And on the website, it looks kind of like a poster. But in reality, when I get it, it's just a regular eight and a half by 11, pretty thin piece of paper, just like the paper that I have um, from my printer. However, it's printed front and back. And the way it's, it's set up is they want you to be able to color this one and then color this one. And then you open it and you have two more to color. And then the last one is on the inside, which I think is great in theory. However, I just feel like I paid too much for these. So they are on the website. The regular price that they have on the website is $1.87. And there are, I believe, 24 pieces in here. Let me look. Yes, 24 sheets of paper for $1.87 is kind of a lot. Um, and it makes each one of these 16 cents. And I know that I can print this off on my printer for much more affordable. Even at the discounted price, I paid $1.12 for these, and they're still 10 cents a sheet, which I think, I, with the way my printer is set up, I think I can print these off myself for a little bit cheaper. However, if you just wanna pay it for it and have it already ready in your hand and not have to do any work, and that's worth it to you, then okay. But for me, I won't purchase these again. Again, they're called Science VBS Fold Up Versus and they're $1.87 for the set. Next, there are not many things in here that I wouldn't get again. This is just happens to be one of them. Next are these buttons. So these are pretty cool. They're called Year is Bright Buttons. They're large, they're the two inch buttons. So a lot of the other buttons at this price are the mini buttons. And I just wanted to have some big ones. And I thought that this was um, generic enough of a saying because a lot of their buttons are real specific like holidays or um, awareness buttons but this one seems to just be fun and colorful and proclaiming something happy in that kiddo's life so these were they come in a 24 pack and oh no okay I thought I lost my little note here these were $2.97 regularly, which makes each button a quarter. And I think that's a fair price for this really nice large button. However, on the discount, I paid $1.78 for these, which makes each button 15 cents. And I can't leave them there for that price. Like I had to pick them up and put them in my cart. 15 cents a button, yes, all day. And they're bright and colorful. Let me tell you, there is a green one and a blue one and an orange one, which is Matt Man's favorite color. Those two are hooked together, let's get a different one. There's the orange one, and a bright pink one, which goes with my outfit today. Yay, so fun. So, they're just bright and colorful, and a nice way to add color and fun to a box for 25 cents a piece, or for me, 15 cents a piece, so I love it. Next, this is another one of those things that I think is a decent quality and I would, I do recommend it. However, I like something else for the same price a little bit better. So what are these? 
These are Dear God pencil cases. So here is what it is. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. This is the Dear God brand, um, and it comes in lots of different things. I have some of these booklets given to me by Sue from Canada, so thanks, Sue, for the books. Um, but these are the pencil packs, and they're decent quality. They're just plastic pencil packs, definitely better than the quality at Dollar Tree. Um, I'm not a huge fan of how these are adhered. If you can see, they're not stitched. They're just... Um, like melted together and that's okay but it's not my favorite um so for this pack of 12 there are three different um little images but they're all the dear god images so that's one of them and then this is the other one and then this is the example i showed you so for 12 i paid seven dollars well not me, let me rephrase that. On the website, they're $7.77 for 12, which is a decent price that makes them 65 cents a piece. However, for that price, I like the ones that you can get on Amazon. They're stitched, they're better quality, and they cost the same. So my recommendation for pencil packs is still Amazon. However, with my discount, they came out to $4.66 for 12 of them, so I'm only paying 39 cents a pack, and for that price, I will pick these up. My plan for these is to fill them up as filler and send them straight to the distribution center for 40 cents, I love it. Okay, next. This is another one of those things that I probably wouldn't purchase again. It's just this stripey thing, and I'm putting together a bee box. Um, this is called Team Spirit Arm Sleeves. So I'm gonna open it up. And basically, it's like a pair of pantyhose that are striped for your arms. So you're supposed to put your little thumb in right there, and it hangs out like this, and it's just for fun. So I'm putting this in my bee box just to kind of be a little dress up fun thing for that little girl. Um, however, they're not the greatest quality. They're not, um, it's kind of like the, the vest. Like this would not be good quality for actual clothing, but for dress up and for play, it's just fine. And um, originally on their website, these are $1.47 a piece, which I don't think I would pay that. Like if this was at Dollar Tree for $1.47, I would not get it. However, with my discount, I only paid 88 cents and I think it's worth that. I think it's worth a few weeks of play for this little girl to dress up like a bee. So take it or leave it for $1.50. I could find something better to spend my money on at Oriental Trading. Next is, let's see, what do we wanna do next? Okay, so that was for an individual and something I didn't recommend. Let's do something that is for the group. This set here, let's take my little note off, is absolutely adorable. So what it is, it is called Rescue Hero Color Bricks. Can you see that? It's a set of Legos already prepackaged put together and ready to go straight to the distribution center as great boy filler, which is kind of hard to find. So I couldn't leave this there. I had to pick this up. It was originally $4.27 on super clearance because I think these packs are usually $15 for a set of 12. I'm pretty sure it's um, meant to be for a birthday party giveaway, but for me, I had to pick these up. So if you bought these for their regular clearance price on the website at $4.27, each of these packs is only 35 cents. But guys, with my discount, I got them for $2.56 for the whole 12 pack, which means each one only costs 21 cents. I had to pick them up. I do have one box I can pop this in, but the other 11 are going straight to the distribution center to be filler for boxes that need a little extra color and a little extra love. How great is that? If you've made it this far, I do wanna tell you that I'm going to do my best to link all of these items down below. And if they're still available, hopefully at that price, because prices fluctuate, 
hopefully you can still pick these up too. So I just was super excited to get these and can't wait to send them in as filler. Okay, another thing that I got, this is a moon. It is called Glow in the Dark Moon Bulletin Board Cutout. So this is kind of similar to those little packets of plastic glow in the dark stars that we used to put all on our ceilings when we were little. Um, however, it's just the moon. And the cool thing about it is there's two different versions, which they're not going to show up on the camera, but I will still attempt to show you. This is version number one, and this is version number two. It's the same print of the moon. However, this one is full glow in the dark. You can feel it. The glow in the dark has a texture to it. And this one, you can kind of see right there, is just a crescent moon glow in the dark. So, um, for me, there are 48 pieces in this pack. I'm gonna put them back in the right place, okay. 48 pieces in this pack, but to me, I would send them with one full moon and one crescent moon. So that makes 24 sets. So originally on the website, this is $1.97. So for 24 sets, that makes them eight cents a piece per set. But for me, I got them for $1.18 and I only paid five cents a piece for each set and I love it. There are so many boxes I can put these in. All of my astronaut ones, I have a Toy Story box that can get this. Um, anything that's kind of science-y like robots, I have a monsters box that kind of, they kind of look like aliens. All kinds of fun boxes can get these moons. And then the rest can go in my pencil pack. Um, I am going to take some double-sided tape that I have and put a piece on the back so that they'll have something to adhere this to their wall or their locker or their ceiling or the foot of their bed. Um, just so they have a way to put this up somewhere to utilize it as decoration. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> this goes over here, this goes over here. Next, this might be my favorite thing I got. I don't know, I might say that a couple more times, but these are necklaces. It's kind of hard to see. They're called Sports VBS Necklaces and there's four different options. I'm gonna pull out this soccer one and show you the example of the whole thing. It is a silicone cross with a sports ball print and a metal necklace with the kind that like, I don't know what you call this attachment, but it clicks open and closed. I don't, I don't know what you call that, but these are high quality. A lot of the other necklaces at the same like price range at Oriental Trading, this was just a, um, like a string. I really like the fact that this comes with a metal necklace. So this is the soccer one. There's also a volleyball and a basketball one and a football one. So for this whole set, there are 12 in this little baggie. Again, these are called sports. VBS necklaces and online they're two dollars and 98 cents which makes them a quarter a piece that's amazing but for me with my discount I paid a dollar 78 or 15 cents per necklace I love it these are going straight into my soccer and basketball boxes and if I don't have a box for the volleyball or the football ones I'll just send them to the distribution center again for more boy filler, which is very difficult to find when you're at the distribution center, filling those boxes. So, drink break. Video game break. Oh, look at the fancy moves. What a nerd, I love him. Okay, back to the box. <laughs> the next thing in here, these are really cool too. These are science BBS verse bracelets. So um, again, this can go in everything those moons can go in. All of my, um, any box that's kind of science-y. So I'm doing a teacher box, that will get this. I'm doing um, 
um, astronaut boxes, I'm doing a robot box, anything that has to do with that gets one of these. There are four different colors. Here's the green one, and this is what it looks like. It just has like a little science medallion, and the verse on here is Psalm 98.1. I don't know what that is off the top of my head. If you know or have a chance to look it up, leave it in the comments below. Um, so there's green and red. How fun for this, superhero boxes. Like Iron Man, he's a sciencey guy. He can get this. Um, blue and purple. This one is going straight into my girl astronaut box. This purple is perfect. I love it. So lots of different boxes that these can go in. There are um, 24 pieces per unit. So I'm getting 24 of these bracelets. They were $2.97 regular on the website, which makes them 13 cents a piece. Isn't that great? However, with my discount, I paid $1.78 and got them for eight cents a piece. I couldn't leave them there. They had to go in my cart and come home to go into my shoe boxes. Okay, we're getting there, folks. We're getting there. So many goodies. The next thing I recommend you scoop up as fast as possible. If it's still available, again, it's linked below. It's a set of bandanas. So it comes in three colors. So you're gonna get four of each color in this beautiful green, blue, so vibrant, and red. Again, really, really beautiful. But it's sports themed, so look at all the fun sports references. 12 of these, full size bandanas, really great quality. I would say just the same quality as is available at Hobby Lobby, so a little nicer than the stuff you get at Dollar Tree. At Hobby Lobby, where I normally buy my bandanas, they're 97 cents a piece, um, and I'm sure that they're gonna go up soon. I wouldn't be surprised if soon you have to pay a dollar ten for bandanas, just with inflation the way it is. So with this, again, these are called sports icon bandanas. And on the website, the price listed for them was $4.47 for 12. That alone makes them 37 cents each. But guys, with my discount, I only paid $2.68 for 12 bandanas, making them 22 cents a piece for these beautiful bandanas. I love it. That's better than Walmart clearance prices. Love it. Okay, another set of bandanas. Not quite as good of a discount, but very needed in my world. Plain pink bandanas. Just a nice pink bandana. General design nothing too fancy but this can be used for so many great things you can wrap a baby doll in this you can line a box in it which is what i like to do this can be used as a hair bow this can be used as a bandana the way that it is intended or this kiddo can use this for actual fabric when they get it they could make a bag or a pencil case or baby doll clothes or barbie clothes all kinds of uses for these light pink bandanas. That's what they're called because it's not a hot pink. Like my shirt is hot pink. It's a lighter. It's not coming across. It's a baby bubblegum pink. That's a good way to describe it. Oriental Trading calls it light pink bandana and on their website they're $9.99 for 12. So already that's 83 cents a piece which again is better than Hobby Lobby for the same quality bandana but I paid $5.99, so I got them for 50 cents a piece. Woohoo! I love it. I love getting a great deal. This is the last thing, so thanks for sticking around, but I think this might be one of the coolest. This is called Railroad VBS Choo Choo's Jesus. It is a kit. It's a little craft kit to put together a foam um, what's this called? Choo-choo train. 
So here are the instructions included in here. And that is what it will look like in the end. This is the outline of the train. And up here it says, choo, 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 Jesus. But the foam stickers are all different colors. And they are stickers, so you don't need any extra glue or scissors. Um, everything is perforated, so they just tear these apart and put them on in the right place. And I'm going to open this one and show you the, um, the instructions so we can see if they are English instructions or generic instructions. Let's see. So here's the little instructions. And when we open it up, no English required. There is some English here telling them a little bit, but you can figure it out by the image without needing to know English. So these are great. I love them. I got a whole dozen of these. This is what they look like. I love it. The package is perfect. I do have several train boxes, so this will go right in there. And the rest of these are going straight to the distribution center as filler, just as they are. Again, another great boy filler craft kit. And I on the website, they're $2.47. And you get 12 kits in here, which makes them 21 cents a piece. How can we pass that up? But with my discount, I only paid $1.41, which made them 12 cents a piece. Isn't that great? Perfect to brighten a kid's day. So, that is my review of some of these things that I purchased from Oriental Trading. I definitely, definitely recommend the bandanas. Great quality. Um, I recommend these necklaces. I recommend the roll stickers. Again, my favorite are the square ones called Wild Encounter. Um, there are some things that I would pass on next time. I would not get, wherever it is, um, the, there they are. I would not recommend getting these. There's several different versions of these for different VBS themes. They're just not worth it in my opinion. Um, you can put in minimal effort and make the same thing for yourself at home. So that's it. Tell me what you think about Oriental Trading. Put a link to your favorite Oriental Trading thing down below. Let's share the knowledge, share the wealth, and I hope that all of you are getting those great discount cards sent to your house sometime soon so that you can utilize the tip for getting $50 worth of stuff for $30. I hope that this helped. I had a lot of fun. Now I'm going to go sit on the couch and watch Matt play his video games for the rest of the afternoon. In case no one has told you, I love you lots. Bye!